Hello there, brothers and sisters. I just want to talk about something here. Because I heard some Rasta people say, use the word Babylon. And Babylon, what's that word mean? What's the word Babylon mean? The word Babylon, well, if you want to know, this is a history. It's history because we're Rasta and we know the right history. So, at one point, this is the story. This is the Rastafari interpretation of the Bible. And this is what really happened. At one point, all the people of the earth, spoke one language, and they decided to build this tower uh, to reach heaven. They decided to build this tower to reach heaven, and the Creator didn't like it. So the Creator decided to make all the people of the earth speak different languages so they cannot complete uh, this tower. And as far as I know, through my interpretation of biblical scripture, is that uh, this tower fell over. It was thrown down, and it burned. Now, if you understand, Babylon was a material thing. It was a structure that was was unable to be completed, and it fell over. And I, and from from biblical interpretation here, the tower burned. Um, now, understanding that Babylon is a material thing. Now, there's other scriptures in the Bible that refers to the word Babylon uh, in the Book of Revelation, uh, and uh, through the rest of our interpretation of the Bible is that Babylon nowadays is just a false spirit. It's a false spirit. So uh, now, and my understanding of, of the word idol means uh, someone worshiping a material thing in place of worshiping the creator. And that's something that's uh, discouraged because that's not the real way. Uh, to the Almighty Most High, King Selassie, Jarastafari, the head creator of the universe. Because Ali Selassie taught the birds how to fly, man. 